Ah, welcome back to Daily Blast Live. Today we are shining the DBL spotlight on probability. That's right, a writer decided to take her chances in poker playing to write a book. Now she's headed to compete in the World Series of Poker. What a crazy turn of events. So, and guess what? It starts today, so you should take a look. Writer for The New Yorker, Maria Konnikova, decided to become a professional poker player to write a book about her experiences. Thing is, Maria is good really good. She started winning big time, well over $100,000. So for now, the book's on hold, and Maria's going all in in professional poker. The poker playing author joins us now. Maria, you started writing up about poker, and now you became a poker player. Walk me through that, please. I am not someone who was ever a poker player, a card player. I hate casinos, never been to Vegas before this experience, except for one wedding, hated it. <laughs> uh, so not someone who you would typically expect to become a poker pro. Um, started writing this book because I was actually very interested in the concept of luck. And that's how I came across poker, as a game that has both a skill and a chance element, and that's actually a really good analogy um, for life. Do you have any competitions coming up we should know about? Yeah, I'm actually going to the World Series of Poker. I am very excited, also nervous, um, because this is gonna be my first full World Series where I play a full schedule. But, you know, I'm, I'm a little scared. I wanna make sure I play my best. I'm doing everything I can to prepare, not just strategically, but also mentally and emotionally. It's exciting. I'm so glad I have the opportunity to do this. Has poker taught you any lessons that you think you've applied to your life? Absolutely. I mean, I think poker is one big lesson for life. It's everything from, you know, how do you think through decisions? How, you know, how do you think about probabilities? So something you have to learn very early on in poker is you can make the best decision possible. So you maximize your skill. Um, and yet there's still going to be a chance element there because you can't control the cards. All right, Maria, we have to know this. Whatever happened to the book? Like, what's the status? When can we look for it? The book is still happening. Um, I even promised a few pages to my editor before I leave for the World Series. Um, <laughs> we're not quite sure when it's coming out, but the current idea is summer, fall 2019. That's exciting. Now, you have to make me one promise. You have to uh, check back in with us after the World Series of Poker. Let us know your thoughts, what your reflections on the entire tournament, because we're really excited and we're pulling for you here at DBL. Thank you. I would love to do that. All right. It was a pleasure. Thank you for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. A professional writer, now a professional poker player? You know, but as I was thinking about this interview, it's like the kind of skill set makes sense. A person that can sit down and write for hours and hours at a time, that kind of same personality, because I talked to her and she said she practices poker and reads on poker probably eight or nine hours a day. This isn't some kind of fish out of water story. I mean, she really works hard at this. So I think that she found a, a lucrative second wow. career or a new career. Good for her. Well done.